These are your instructions on creating your own stained glass window. We took some time before Thanksgiving to draw out our design. So everyone should have a design that looks similar to this. Remember we started with one big object in the middle. I used my woodpecker. And then we drew lots of other shapes and lots of other lines around that object. So now we have lots of shapes that we can start filling in with lots of different colors. And I want you to use a lot of colors because that's what make a makes a stained glass window pretty is when you have a lot of colors and a lot of shapes. So we have our shapes drawn. Now it's time to start painting them in. We're going to use a little visual technique, a little visual trick that a lot of artists use if they want to give their object a two-dimensional feel, if they want it to look like there's two parts to the design. So you're going to pick out a frame that you want to use. It may be hard to see on here, but there's plastic in the middle.